friends, family, faculty, students, and Jimmy Conklin. This is Jake the Snake. And this is Leah Berea. And we would like to be your 2015-2016 class officers. Nothing is more important than your senior year. As senior class presidents, it will be our duty <laughs> to make our senior year memorable. We are the perfect balance between silliness and seriousness. And we are finally going to get those Kool-Aid water fountains, right? No. It's time to enjoy senior year then. As everyone knows, in just a few short months, we are all going to be diagnosed with a very serious illness. That's right, senioritis. Symptoms include laziness, drowsiness, and lack of motivation. And that's where we come in. We want to make your senior year the most exciting year of your high school career. Prom will be the bomb. Dot com. Graduation will exceed your expectations. Economic inflations. I will continue to support the sorority. And gentlemen, I will work to get back our fraternity. We will work to get our senior privileges early too. We will increase support for clubs and make sure the stands are packed for everyone's senior night. We will endorse senior involvement. We plan to make pep rallies more enjoyable and entertaining, especially for the most important class, senior class. We will make sure to get the word out about upcoming events so you can be involved in any and every activity for your last year of high school. We have the best senior class, so make sure you vote for us so you can have the best class officers. I'm Leah. And I'm Jake. And we approve this message. I'm Derek DeBerger. I'm Joshua Hurt. I'm running for senior class president. I'm uh, running for senior class vice president. And we are very excited to have a chance to improve the school any way possible. People come to us and say, if you would get elected president, can you do this? And can you do that? We say, 300 bang bang, so so. That's right. Also, what we're going to do when we become president and vice president is we're going to change how pep rallies are. Uh, I don't know how they're done, so they're more fun, and they aren't as bad as they are now. No offense, ASB. And we'll also see if we can try to change dress code. We just want to alter it slightly so that there's more student cooperation around the school. And also the lunch on Thursdays, because that's it's not that good, honestly. I don't know the people that eat it. I mean, we could honestly get something better that's not very poisonous. Well said. Uh, well, we hope we can count the vote for president and vice president. Uh, yeah, we're good. One Nation Under Squad. Yes. Derek and Josh, president, vice president. Yes. Good morning, afternoon, or evening, OCHS. I'm Lexi Stepro. And I'm Seth Boaz. We're running to be your senior class vice president and senior class president. When voting, ask yourself, who do you trust to plan your prom and voice your needs and wants to the administration? Who do you trust more to dedicate their time to make your senior year the best year of your life? The answer is us. We have a very particular set of skills, like Liam Neeson. Well, enough to make a sequel. <laughs> oh, uh, that was uh, good. But all jokes aside, <laughs> I want this. And so do I. We won't make promises we can't keep. That being said, we promise to give our all to make our last year a good one. No, a great one. This isn't just a thing that we want to put on our college applications. This is a job we will take seriously and carefully. In conclusion, Seth, why did the Scarecrow win a Nobel Prize? Why did he, Lexi? Because he was outstanding in his field. Thank you. This is... <laughs> Reagan. Hi everyone, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Kelly Duvall and I want to be your junior class representative. Over the past two years here at OCHS, I've gotten the chance to know and meet my fellow classmates and as I have, I've gotten an even better chance to realize how much potential you all each hold. Potential to be leaders, to make a difference, and potential to work and follow your dreams. As your hopeful elected junior class representative, I hope to bring out the best in each of you and let your voices be heard. For those of you who don't know me, I have been a part of the Lady Colonel soccer team for the past three years. From eighth grade to sophomore year, I have seen myself build into a leader, and I believe the same leadership I offer on the field can be the same leadership I portray off the field and in our school. 
I can also tell you that I want to set an example for our junior class, a class I feel holds so much greatness and confidence to do great things within our school and our world outside the hallways of OCHS. As your junior class representative, I promise to listen to your voices with an open mind and open heart and give you the chance to be heard. I promise to initiate change as needed to bring out the best versions of ourselves within the school and to lead by example in all fair and approachable ways. I would like to represent you all, class of 2017, in a big way by contributing time and dedication to make you know that your opinion matters here at OCHS. This is your school. Let your voice be heard. And give me the opportunity to help you do that by voting me, Kelly Duvall, as your junior class representative. Hey, I'm Kirby Williamson, and I'm running to be your junior class representative. If you know me, you probably know that I've been dealing with some medical issues this year. One upside to this challenge, I've met more of you than I could ever imagine. You all helped me when I was down, literally. And I started to talk to you, some of you all at least, about how you would like to change the school. I wish I could say I was half as creative as you all, or funny or witty, or had an outgoing personality, but that's not my job. My job is to be the connection between you all and ASB. I've heard some great things from you all, such as one person wanted to do a glow-in-the-dark dodgeball competition for our class. That's pretty cool if you ask me. If you know me, you would also know that I'm a giant nerd who loves this school. And you all have some amazing ideas that could help this school, and I would love to be the person who helped you all make your dreams come true. I want to do the best thing for our school, and I want our class to stand out. I want our class to have an awesome student section for our great athletes, and I want our class to be the one that makes this school fun and happy for everyone. You walk through the halls and I see straight faces. What if we filled the walls with art and filled the hallways with laughter? I believe this is possible and I believe you all have the power to do so. And I think you all need someone who will listen to you and your ideas in order for this goal to be achieved. Thank you all so much for everything you do for me. I'm honestly really lucky to be surrounded by really cool and fun people that are filled with awesome ideas. Vote for Kirby, I've got your back. Hello class of 2018. I am Rachel Gibson and I'm running for re-election as class president for our sophomore year. As freshman president, I have worked really hard to represent our freshman class by recycling, organizing, and executing the fundraiser for our freshman t-shirts, cleaning up the OCHS student memorial, planning the incoming freshman orientation, and participating in fundraisers for the upperclassmen. So Drew, is this what has you interested in running for vice president? I don't know. I quit listening after you said you were running for re-election. You're really good at this, by the way. I'm going to vote for you. Thank you, Drew. I'm going to vote for you, too. Well, what's the reason you're running for vice president? Well, I see this as an opportunity to get to know everyone in the class of 2018. I would like to be more involved in our school and student community, and I heard this would be, help me be more popular with the ladies as well. And I'll be first in line in the cafeteria, right? Uh, no, Drew, you can't be first in line. There are absolutely no perks at all. It takes a lot of hard work. So you can't sit around watching Netflix during ASB? Not if you want to be a good leader. So, Drew, tell everybody about yourself and why you think you'd be a good VP. Well, I'm smart, handsome, lightning fast, funny, and I'm really good at soccer. I have eagle vision and tiger blood racing through my veins. Uh, that's great, Drew. I'm an Aquarius and have hazel eyes. But when I ran for president last time, I made sure to point out all the good qualities about myself such as my leadership roles, that I was an athlete, that I volunteer a lot. Do you have any good qualities that you want to share? Oh, I'm kind of organized. I'm a hard worker, so I'll help, you with all, I'll help you out with all the stuff you did by yourself this school year. I'm a good team member and captain of our soccer team now, so I have experience with leading. I volunteer in the community and at church. I want to be VP, so that says something, I think. That's perfect, Drew. Being president and vice president aren't just titles that we get. Being elected... President and VP means that we will work hard for our class and do the things that we promise in our speeches. We do promise to work hard for you. Please vote for Rachel and Drew. Do you have any quotes you want to leave our class with today? Yeah, I do. It's a Jim Carrey quote. Behind every great man is a woman rolling her eyes. <sighs> the two of us have what it takes to be your president and vice president. And together as a team, we will work hard for you to get the job done. Please vote for us. Hi, I'm Maddie Houck. And I'm Allie Florence. And we want to be your sophomore class president and vice president. Maddie Swag, what qualifies you for this position? Well, I'm no longer number one on the Kim Kardashian game because this year I decided to focus on more important things, like taking quizzes to find out which Avenger I am, Captain America, because I love this country and everyone in it. What qualifies you, Allie Flo? Well, this year I've done some self-reflection and realized I'm a lot like Hannah Montana. Super cool, super hot, living like a rock star. 
But I've also realized that nobody's perfect and I gotta work it again and again till I get things right. And we're all in this together to get your sophomore year right. But seriously, Maddie, what qualifies you to be a next class president? Well, throughout middle and high school, I was involved in many leadership activities, such as CUNA, KYA, and student council. And this year, I've had the opportunity of being your freshman class vice president. So I'm very prepared for the role I'll be taking next year if elected. As for me, I've played the part of freshman ambassador and I've been able to observe my role model, Maddie swag -Hauk, take on the position of vice president with passion. We're no Sharpay Ryan Evans, but we sure can bop to the top to take on higher leadership roles in the 2015-2016 school year. This is the start of something new. So get your head in the game. And vote for Mad Dog and Alley Cat to be your sophomore class president and vice president. Hello, I'm Logan Richardson and I'm running for sophomore representative. I wanted to start my speech off with a quote from one of my inspirations, so here it is. I came out to have a good time and honestly I'm feeling so attacked right now. Kim Kardashian. I don't want anyone to feel attacked ever. I feel like as your representative I can make our, I can make our voice heard and make sure that other classes do not attack us. I wanted to continue my speech with a quote from one of my inspirations, so here it is. I realize that my place and position in history is that I will go down as the voice of this generation, of this decade. I'll be the loudest voice, Kanye West. I want our class to be remembered, and I feel like as a representative, I can make a good impact in our school community. I wanted to finish my speech with a quote from one of my inspirations, so here it is. My name is Logan Richardson, and I'm running for freshman representative. That was me, and I was later elected by you, and I've learned so much. I feel like I can use my past experience as your freshman representative to help us achieve even the greatest of goals. So vote for me for your sophomore representative. Hi, my name is Regan Nyker, and I'm running for your sophomore class representative. The Queen Bee, Beyonce, has taught me a lot throughout the years, like who actually runs the world, girls, and that if you sneeze on a beat, it really does get sicker. But seriously, I feel qualified to be your sophomore class representative because in the last few years, I've been involved in many extracurriculars, such as KYA, CUNA LTC and lots of other activities. Through these opportunities, I've gained numerous qualities, including leadership and communication skills and the ability to recognize multiple perspectives. If elected, I will listen to you. I will bring your concerns to the attention of ASB members and I will make sure your voice is heard. So vote for me, the single lady, Reagan Nykirk, for your sophomore class representative, XO. Uh, hello, my name is Jacob Bates and I am asking for your vote for OCHS Athletic Commissioner. I am an active member of the ba basketball and baseball teams here at OC. I feel like I am the best candidate to fill this position for our school. I understand the importance of student participation and attendance at all of our school sporting events. I plan on working towards increasing in attendance at our school's less emphasized sports. Nothing helps motivate our student athletes like, we, like knowing we care about the sport they have dedicated so much time and effort representing OC. I spent the last three years supporting all of our boys and girls sports, wearing out my sports pass. As a student athlete at OC, I can attest to all the times it's personally improved my performance and pushed me to do that as much as I could to help my team succeed. As a senior, I would like for my last year to be hyped with school spirit. I'd like to get each student at OC to experience the fun and excitement of a high school sporting event. Oldham County High School has a rich tradition of being the best, and I want to continue spreading the word about all the talented and dedicated athletes that will take the field and court next year. Thank you for listening. Once again, I'm Jacob Bates and I would appreciate your vote for OCHS Athletic Commissioner. Hi, my name is Ashley Spillman and I'm running for Athletic and Spirit Commissioner. You may know me from track, cross country, FCA, or beta club. I'm asking for your vote and I believe that I am the best candidate for commissioner because of my outgoing and accepting personality, my involvement in the school, and my leadership experience. I've served as an ambassador before where I planned, hosted, and spoke at many events such as the beta induction, graduation, and various assemblies. This year I had the privilege of giving incoming freshmen a tour of our school. If elected, I will work to increase the recognition of more students for their academic, artistic, and athletic achievements through OTVX, the Clarion Colonel, yearbook, and assemblies. I also think we should reward students through celebrations that would include free food and getting out of class, which I know we all love. Thank you for your time, and don't forget to hop out of your Porsche and whip your way to the voting table and vote me, Ashley Spillman, as your Athletic and Spirit Commissioner. Hi, 
Hi, my name is Allie Thomas and I'll be a sophomore. I'm running for Alumni and Community Relations Officer next year. I've been interested in ASB and feel this position and my personality and interest would be a great fit. Currently, I'm involved in Beta Club, the tennis team, active in my church youth group, and volunteer at the Humane Society of Oldham County. I also help teach Vacation Bible School and help with Easter and Halloween events at my local church and have been on several mission trips. I'm organized, dependable, and hardworking and have all the qualities and skills needed to get the job done. I'm Allie and hope to serve this position for the 2016 school year. Thank you. Hi, I'm Madeline Burgess and I'm running for your PTSA booster and alumni liaison. I feel that I would be a great representative for your, our school during our PTSA meetings. With this position, I will represent the student body first and second, I will have your input relaying that to the committee. I am involved in many activities such as beta, FCA, and volleyball. Last year, I was chosen by my fellow classmates to be a student ambassador at East Oldham Middle School. This opportunity has allowed me to have leadership roles within my class. I planned and organized pep rallies and other various school events. This shows I have great leadership abilities and ideas. By living in Oldham County my whole life, I have gained relationships with community members that will be willing to support different school events. I would like to start involving alumni more in the school activities. I think we could better utilize, utilize social media to um, give them greater awareness of upcoming events. Thank you for your consideration and vote for Madeline for PTSA Booster and Alumni Liaison. Hi guys, my name is Casey Smekrud and I'm running for PTSA Booster Alumni. I'll start with a simple question. Do you enjoy coming to school every day? Most students will probably say no and that's what I want to help change. I want you to enjoy school by being your voice in PTSA meetings and every day in the classroom. I know that meeting your needs is going to be hard, but I'm ready to accept that challenge and put forth my best effort for you. I play soccer, which has taught me how to be a positive leader in negative situations. And I've learned that through hard work, you can accomplish pretty much anything. I've also had a lot of experience with leadership and listening to people's ideas and opinions and bringing them all together to create something I didn't think was possible. In the Arvin Center, I'm in the Engineering Academy for first and second period, and we have to be leaders every day. And I've seen how ordinary students just like you and I can put cardboard together to make fro floating boats or straws into a flying kite. It's pretty amazing what we can accomplish as students, and I want to share what I've learned with you so that we can make your time at this school great. So let me represent you because I'm ready to put 100% of my effort into making every year better than the last. 